Well, I uh, didn't think it'd be right if we didn't have some kind of uh, video diary as we set out to do this. We need your prayers. We need your support. We're going into border areas of, of uh, the border this country and we're helping people. You, you think you have to go halfway around the world to get into some desolate places and it's just not true. You think you have to go halfway around the world to see some war and some, some death. It's happening right here. Well the story is this. Uh, we're out to uh, help some people that are desperately in need of help. Uh, we're going to try to uh, lift their spirits, let them know that uh, people are actually uh, out to help them. We're going to supply them with some desperately needed food uh, and uh, just provide as much assistance as we can while we're here. Helping humanity is one of the biggest passions of my heart. Say what you want about me, but I love people and I love helping people. I have the strong desire to help these people. Right on the border of this country, on both sides that need our help because their, be their lives are being destroyed because of conflict between one group and another group, and they're caught in the middle. And we're going down to help feed them and to, and to see what they're, to, see, to, to help meet their needs. And uh, we're asking you to help us. There's people that are already stationed in this location that are called to help these people because they're right smack in the middle of this war zone. And they need as much support uh, to help them in their cause as well, because they're called to help these people. Well, we're getting closer to our point of destination. We're, we've actually found a small community out here in the middle of nowhere. They have an RV park. They have a Valero gas station. And a cell phone tower. And a cell phone <laughs> tower. <laughs> Time for something to drink. Make the next legal U turn. And water the plants. We are in full force at the Operation Border Relief. We're heading somewhere within the United States along its wonderful borders. And we're going to help some hurting people. The reason I would step out and put myself in a hazardous situation like this is because of a uh, strong desire to be obedient to God's calling uh, to act in this, this uh, situation and uh, a strong compassion to help people that are in need. I'm looking forward to it, a little anxious, a little nervous, and uh, I look forward to coming back. It's amazing how much logistics goes into a trip like this. Food for the car, food for your body. How easy is it to forget or take for granted the food that we eat. Some people don't have this. We're here to help.